Shock. <laughs> Why does the Titan do no damage 12 minutes in? Because the Titan sucks. He has a bot. Board of Jazz yet? Nah. I'm less here for the joust, more here for the people. Feel me, Ratify? I mean, I wouldn't be streaming if uh, I was just here for the joust, you feel me? Gilly's Atlas. That could be a little scary, huh? Glad we were on the same page. I don't know. I don't mind the jazz though. I'm enjoying this uh, goal I set for myself of Masters Border All Warriors. Been finding myself like really wanting to actually grind it. It's been a good time. And it's it's a toughy one. Toughy one, but it is achievable. Well, I just banned these two guys. Ban Kulu. Nah, I'm good. I think if they pick Kulu, we just insta win, so. I'll be good. Yeah, percent mitigations are the most consistent way to survive in the game. Stacks really nicely with my shock protections from my two as well. Because the protections will make me take less damage, and then that damage will be reduced even more with the mitts. <laughs> yeah, Pete? I love Joust! Joust, 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 Joust. I mean, I enjoy it. I don't know. wonder if the percent applies before or after regular pros and how does percent pen affect it. Well, it would apply after, and percent pen doesn't do anything. Percent pen strictly applies to protections. Mitigations are a completely separate things. So mitigations take the damage that you would have taken, factoring in all your protections, reducing the damage, and then, so let's say... I were to take 100 damage from my ability, my protections reduce that damage to 50. I have 12% mitigations, that'll take off 6 damage from that 50. Damage mitigation trumps all, including true damage. Yes, indeed. If you get fire blinked on, and that fire blink, of course, is hitting you for 100 damage a tick late game and you have 12% mitigations, that fire blink will hit you for 88. True damage beats mitts? No. No, it doesn't. Percent damage increase works against mitigations. That's, that's the only thing that counteracts mitts. And they work one for one ratio. So if I get a Spear of the Magus proc on someone, which is what? 5% increased damage, and they have 12% Oni's mitts, they'll be only mitigating 7%. Thought true was damage. True goes through protections. So, 100 protections, considering the guy hitting you has no pen, will reduce damage by 50%. If the damage is true damage, Please that damage won't quiet. get reduced. Cancel that. Unless they have mitigations. <laughs> Alright, um, I think I kind of got to get a sprint for the squadron here. Yep. Gotta get that. Minus execute. Actually, if you get 100% mitts, you actually immune execute. The only thing is, like, very tough to get 100% mitts. But if I have... I get 70% when I ult at level 20. If I get 30% mitts, then I actually will immune the execute. So I think if I have like a Kabrakan passive and maximum mitts, and an Achilles tries to execute me and I Achilles or a shock ult it, I will immune it.
But that realistically happening is not a thing. <laughs> Shock with E-set? Indeed. You could do that. Oh, shoot. The Uller missed XP. That's interesting. I can sprint him if he needs it. He didn't trust my shock rain. You guys see that? He's a non-truster of me. I'm kind of enjoying this blue buff. Oh, long ability. This is going nice and slow. Nice and slow. Should be able to kill this guy. Might be able to turn this. Might. Hmm. Ah, strong might. I'm gonna hit this. Oh, never mind. I'm gonna take this opportunity to try and get a quick back. Then maybe I can get back in time to. Ooh, she's gonna kill him? Nice. Wait for the blue stun to run out. Right. They probably did red, but I'm going to run over and check. Make sure they did. Nope, not yet. I think I should rush this, even though x is about to get here, just so we can pick this up. Be right back. Okay. And Achilles should not outsecure me, right? Got it. And shock secure is so good, bro. And I got the big zoning rain. It's actually so good, man. What's up, poorly man? First weeks of 90% mid, Robin. Yeah, that was not a great fight. None of us have oh, only box had a finished item. Actually, he might not even have that. He might have just got that when he died. They're not on top of these. Sex ball is playing well. I like it. I like it. I like it, Scotty the cutie. Not often I see a bottom MMR that I'd never seen the name of before doing well. Not super often. Good in 3v3 and conk. Feel like you're just chasing people around with a little follow-up. <laughs> Tough luck. Hey. Yeah, I think you should be fine across all game modes. Uh, it's 172 fits, but like I'm still doing that in conk, right? Honestly, this should be kind of an abysmal matchup for Uller. He's just never gonna damage me.
There it is. No, oh, I tanked it. Nice. I gotta go this way. Sheesh! Oh, the circuitry. Wait, I'm coming here. We must try to stay positive. Double kill. Killing screen. I forgive you. Finish this. I think that guy has a. Oh, wait, no, he doesn't have to kill his ult. He ulted as he died. Let's try and steal this, I guess. God, it's such high HP. Huh. Elite shit, probably. I do have Scepter. I mean, I can get it, but yeah, that guy's gonna show up. Yeah, I'll give it. On my way. Probably for a cheeky steal, but. We must go. Alright, mana problems are a thing of the past after I finish this. I'll be looking good. Doesn't seem to compute with the last upgrade. Doesn't seem to with the last upgrade. Mm mm mm. Atlas got a little angry. Well, bet. The double shell team, bro. Ah, uh, what a classic. Contagion spreading. They're using a lot of resources on me. But hit me with that? <laughs> really? <laughs> My range should make this relatively impossible to play for our uh, specifically Achilles and Uller. So the game hasn't even gotten to the worst part for them. So if we just avoid like super committal fights, we should just win this pretty easily, I think. Just gotta be a little careful. Well, so much for that. I can definitely defend this though. Alright. We are down. I'll get a horrific because they went double shell. And it's a really good item. So, I just need to be a little bit uh, more careful, not because they're going to kill me, but because my teammates are like, really coming to help, and they don't need to do be doing all that. I can, they can let me be a solo agent. They just don't know that. So, I'll take my foot off the gas a bit and play a little bit more defensively. Not like defensively, but not as hyper aggro. I say as I go after their blue. If they do fire, we just take their stuff. Why did it take them so long? That's interesting. hard on this poke battle. Nice. 
joint album. Rip. An ally has been slain. An ally has been slain. Well, I'm gonna get a quick reset off. They're not pushing this anyway. These guys are just not respecting what they're able to do. That's okay. We'll figure it out. Mindset's there, so. Could be an okay spot. Not the issue this upgrade can't handle. Mm -mm -mm. Eight CDs? Nah. We just prioritize the stats that we need more. Yeah, Jordan's bigger. Oh, he does. Mm, can't get him. And he's dead. Killing spree. Be careful. Falling back. All right. I uh, will get a Prit here, and then I'll end with a probably a Chins actually. What could be more needable than cooldown? Uh, probably a Contagion, Onis. If I had to guess. Just going on a limb here, though. Oh wait, a second horrific. Why wow, this is actually really good. Dude, I need you to get the tower. See, like they're just trying too hard to kill them. They don't. They don't recognize like what's a win, and what's worth going for. It's the biggest problem. You are clearly like, you. We don't need to kill them, guys. <laughs> poke them really hard and take their objective. I'll let him know. Oh god, I hate typing. Battle is one through technology, but this will do. Okay, I'm on it. There we go. All right, they've been learned. Ultimate is ready. Too easy. 
I'm going rogue. When I get chins, it's gonna get 5,000 times better. I'm just gonna box them so easily. I should have gotten chins instead of Pridman here. I'm just gonna leave here because I'm level 18, so. We'll let my boys get some farm too. Yeah, my hunter go for purple after you got a triple, they spawn bag, we don't get the tower. That is unlucky, man. That is unlucky. I think I'm actually going to prioritize getting chins over redstone here. Friendly enough. Alright, we're X ball at. He's chilling, he's chilling. Return to base. Well, that's all. All pretty easy. Mm, we just need to play like super careful. All I, I just need him to be alive. That's all I really need. I don't need him to do an immense amount of damage. If he gets in like five autos, and that's probably good enough. I can take care of the rest. But I do really want this shins. Is Cad Club good into shock? You mean I, I assume you mean as shock. Uh I wouldn't get it now. I don't think you really need it. That is something that they did, Pandrew. Hit that guy. I'll let them pull it. Or my axe up. They can't really fight through my rain. That's the big thing. it. That is sad. I hope he lives. I don't even want to stick around for him. I don't think it's worth it. I don't think I'm killing them either, so I'm not even going to buy this. Is he going to live? Oh, if he lives, that's cool. Dang. Not an issue this upgrade can't handle. <laughs> they can't get past me. And now this is an Uller with a really low attack speed. Oh, this is going to be so much fun for. Oh, I am about to have so much fun. Alright, I'm sitting up. 2k gold until greatness. Mm-mm-mm. Got the late game shock. 
What a world we live in where late game shock is actually like really, really crazy good. <laughs> Alright, game's over. GG. Achilles and Alice Holt are so good, but then Redstone Shock. With an upgrade. If Uller does something absolutely crazy and sneaks around the back, I'll be able to deal with that. Or we'll know he's coming at least. Oh shit. You should be able to kill that before. Little faster! I think I can kill them now. Oh, we don't need to retreat. <laughs> oh, we don't need to retreat. Don't you worry about that, big man. I've got the situation under control. <laughs> GG, we won. What I'm watching is criminal. Come on it, boys. Alright. That's a level 20 Uller, by the way. Really scary guy. As you know, late game powerhouse. Gotta watch out for him. Retreat! Retreat! <laughs> oh, baby! God, the shockening. I love the shockening. It's actually just so hard to beat that late game. Ooh! Yeah, when they play like a tank game, a character like that is just going to own. Shock is unkillable. He's pretty good. Let's look at these prods here. Ooh, pretty low. Shock. Devious shock. And I, yeah, that build just came together real nicely. Only other thing I would have done there is I think I would have replaced Pridwin with... Um, or not replaced. I would have upgraded Pridwin to blue Pridwin, actually. Typically, I would go explosive Pridwin on shock. But I was going for more of an auto attack smelt down so i would rather have a really big shield that they can't handle super well because they didn't go horrific didn't go green xe no erosion like you know no anti-shield so with my max prots of each i'd have over max prots of corruptive blue stone stacks in my two my blue pridwin shield would probably be somewhere around 1400 health which could be pretty effective so definitely would have been doing that but yeah, that game kind of just like went late and they didn't really have any way to deal with me. Uh, my teammates dying actually kind of like helped me in a way because I just got so much extra gold and XP and was able to finish my build a lot quicker than I normally would. Obviously, the game would have been a little bit easier if they weren't dying and we were playing the fights properly. But once I hit that late game stage, comp like that without the proper tools to slow me down is going to struggle greatly so uh, ggs the shockening